What's going on, guys? I should have did a story about this yesterday, but yesterday, the evil bastard known as John William King was executed yesterday. I'm pretty sure by lethal injection because electric chair. I don't know if there's electric chair in Texas still, but lethal injection, whichever way, at least he was taken out. For those of you who don't know, in a because I don't remember the exact year, because I did the story about this last time. So in the 1900s, I would say in the 50s or 60s or 70s, the black guy that you see in the back, um, you know, he was they were getting off from work, and they offered him a ride, him and three other guys, this guy and three other guys. And the three other guys are, one of them is doing life in prison, the other one died. He, he was executed in 2011, if I remember. And, you know, he, uh, they just killed him. They offered him a ride, the black guy. He was getting off work. And they took him to a discreet location. And they hogtied him to the back of the truck. And they dragged him for three miles. Could you believe how painful that is? Just imagine you're in uh, gym class and some uh, asshole, he could be a bully, if you're just sitting down or not on the floor. And then let's say the teacher stepped out for a little bit. And, you know, he just want to be an asshole. And, and he grabs you by both of your foot. Or, or in the, I don't know where they put the rope at, uh, but sorry about that. But And then he just started dragging you. Basically, there's nothing you can do about it unless you're like a self-defense uh, uh, expert or something. And you took some classes on which you could twist and turn your body in some ways and make him, uh, like, let go of you. There's really nothing you could do about it. You can't reach out, reach to in front of him because you're always going to be at a short arm's length. Uh, no pun intended. But... You know, this guy, and he was uh, scraped against gra uh, gravel. Like, he hit rocks there. His, I believe it, one of his right arm or left arm came off, and his head came off. And these bastards kept dragging him even after they, uh, uh, after that he died and all that stuff. And, you know, I guess they thought, since they were white in good old Texas back in those days, they, they was going to get away with it. And trust me, there was a lot of messed up things that happened to black people back then and they, the white people did get away with it and it's crazy because some of those white people could still be alive today and they're old or whatnot and a black person might be taking care of them in a daycare home but they're not going to say that they're not going to say anything about it but you know it's pretty messed up a lot of evil things happen in america still happening today just they yeah, most of it, it's the police that's doing most of it the evil things now but i'm glad that this son of a b-i-c-c-h biatch was killed yesterday he deserved it nothing more nothing less but you guys let me know what you think in the comments subscribe share the video i will talk to you guys in the next video should be coming up soon uh, i want to say uh my heart go out to the bird family b y r d and you know i'm glad that they got justice finally all three of them has been taken care of i'll talk to you guys in the next video